Hello everybody, this is Tracy from Tracy's Personal Training, Pilates and Yoga Studio, and the author of nine books. This is my ninth book, it's a children's book, my first children's book. It's called Your Brain, The Engine to Your Body, Kids Edition. It's actually the Kids Edition of this book, Your Brain, The Engine to Your Body, A Fitness Trainer's Guide to Brain Health. So, in the children's book, I wanted to read a little part to you guys. So. In here, we talk about, you know, laughing, drinking water, eating well. It's really good for your brain, and it's good for helping you learn. You can learn better in school and hear and focus more. But I'm also going to talk a little about hearing aids because I had a hearing loss growing up, and we didn't know I had it. In fact, when I couldn't concentrate in school, I had a hard time with reading. I had a hard time with understanding the multiplications when it came to, I think it was third grade we're having that in, second, third, fourth grade of learning. They tried to tell me it's because my parents were divorced and I'm having a hard time. The hearing tests we had in schools were we all lined up in the cafeteria and you did maybe two seconds with a nurse, raise your hand, raise your hand, you heard your beep, you know, you hear this, you hear that, and then you move on. And it wasn't until I was an adult that we realized I actually really have severe hearing loss. I was just really good at reading lips. But until I realized I had a hearing loss and adjusted to it and I started getting hearing aids, um, I started learning better, reading better, comprehending better, speaking better. I still speak sometimes with words don't come out quite right because our brains do hear different when you have a hearing loss. So, and this pertains to, to you know, kids that you can hear, but you don't hear completely well. So I had to put this in there because I know kids get bullied. Sometimes you don't understand you have a hearing loss. So if you look at this picture here, she is on the swing set. She has a hearing aid in her ear. If you look really close to right there, because nowadays they can make cute colored ones for kids. So. so let me read this part to you here. Some people have hearing loss and need to wear hearing aids. When we do not hear well, it makes our brains extra tired. Tell your parents if you think you'd be having trouble hearing in school. And then she's playing on the swing set. And then we turn the page. And hearing aids will help you hear your teachers and friends more clearly. You still could, you could still play and have fun like other kids, even if you wear hearing aids. And there she's jumping rope and she's wearing her hearing aid. Then it goes on to just kids without hearing aids. Just all, all just having fun and exercise and how it's good for your brain and your health. Remember, the brain is the engine to your body. So if we eat well and 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 take care of things. If you need hearing aids, try to get hearing aids. You know, if your kids need hearing aids. Um, for teachers, you know that kids get bullied if they don't seem to fit in sometimes. And sometimes they may appear they don't fit in, but they may not be hearing well and they don't even know they have hearing loss. Because you can have hearing loss and still function and you don't really realize you're missing little things. That's how I was. I just thought, I actually thought I was just not a very smart person because I had to take special reading and other classes and being taken out of the classroom to have tutors to help me read better and try, so I comprehend things better. But then when I realized I had a hearing loss and got hearing aids, that's what I needed. My ears just needed help. Just like some of us have to wear glasses, some of us have to wear hearing aids. Um, we all just have to take care of what we're, we have. So your brain, the engine to your body, kids edition. And it's the kids edition to Your Brain, the Engine to Your Body, a fitness trainer's guide to brain health. This is for adults. And um, if you look real close, she is reading that book. So here you go. So this is good for kids, students, teachers, parents, grandparents. It could help, you know, if your grandparent or one of your parents have a hearing loss. It just, it just helps you. But it isn't all about hearing loss. There's just a few pages in there about it because... When we wear hearing it, wear, see there, I'm talking funny. When you wear hearing aids, when you have hearing loss, it's healthier for your brain for many reasons. So I hope you guys get the book, you enjoy the book, and have a great day.